Hello, in this video I'm going to be going through my 2023 Advent of Code Day 1 uh, solution in JavaScript. So let's get straight into it. Firstly, we have this input and the problem is asking us to find the first and the last digit of each line, concatenate them and add it to the total sum. So here we have 1 and 2, so that's going to be 12. Here we have 3 and 8, so that's going to be 38. Here we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, so that's just going to be 15 because we take the first one and the last one. And here we have 7. So that's just going to be 77, as 7 is the first and the last one, being the only digit there. So now with our test input, we can paste this into our input file. Then here I'm just using fs um, to read out the file as a string. Then what I can do is for let line of input, dot split at each new line uh, we're going to have a total so let total equal zero and then for each new line we want to go through each character see if it's numeric and if it is then that's a possible value that we could have um, as one of the digits of our total so we can say line dot split to go through each item um, we can do that now. So we can say filter each element and then we can say is not a number. We want it to be not is not a number. So it is a number. Um, and then we can parse int the element. And then what we can do is just set that to numbers. Now what we can do is just add it to the total. So total plus equals numbers 0 and then numbers numbers minus uh, numbers dot length minus 1 and we can't add this on as a string it needs to be a integer so we just do parse int now if we console dot log total we get 142 so that is the correct value, I believe. Yeah, 142 we can see here. Um, and yeah, so now I'm just going to get the full input and paste that in. Uh, I need to run it here. And then we get 55621. And we can see here the value was 55621. So that is correct. Now part two is slightly different. Um, basically we need to consider uh, digits that are spelled out or numbers that are spelled out. Um, so the way that we need to do that is convert them to digits somehow. Um, the way that I did it is through number mappings. So for example here, what it means is here it would be 2, 1, 9. Um, so it would be 29 as the value. Here it would be 8, uh, 2, 3. So it would be 823 or 83 in the end. So the way that I did this is I got the number mappings. So I say const number mappings are going to be these. 1 is going to be 1, 1, 1. And the reason for this is if we have a value like here, 8, 2, if we ignore the 3, then this is just going to be um, 8 first. And then we're going to just have W, O, which isn't going to allow us to do the 2, um, which is something that you need to consider for this problem. So this way I'm getting 8, and then I'm re leaving the string 8 on. Um, to ensure that I don't cut off anything required in any other numbers. So here I'm doing uh, 1, and then I can do this for all of the other ones, basically. So I'm just going to copy these a bit, and then I can do 2, 3, 4, 
five, and we only need up to uh, nine. Eight, and finally nine. And now we've got these mappings. Uh, now what you can do is go through all of the um, numbers in the mappings. So here we can say for let num of object dot keys number mappings, and then we can say um, item is equal to item dot replace all. So we want to replace all occurrences where the number is present, so one, with the number mappings of the number. Then uh, that should be it, I believe. Now if we run this, uh, item is not defined. Uh, that's because it is actually line I believe yeah there you go so 53592 um, if I just check here 53592 um, so that works fine um, so pretty fairly nice day um, but a fairly hard day one I think um, so yeah that was my solution in JavaScript to Advent of Code day one for 2023